Hey, it's Michael Frymus. Um, looks like we're about 50 feet up doing some climbing. I'm doing some photography filmmaking and I'm here with the one and only. With Sarah and we're at Mount Nemo. I'm a rock climber and uh, yeah, just climbed halfway up. Still have halfway to go. Yeah. I don't know how she's managing to do this. I'm just here. I got pulled up and I'm struggling. My legs are shaking. Like, look at this. Oh. <laughs> I, I can't. My legs are shaking so much. We'll blame it on the cold. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cold too. Not a great day. But yeah, I mean, having fun. And I'm uh, just gonna finish filming Sarah. And there is Ryan. Hi. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's continue this. I guess we'll see you at the top. Yep. All right. I don't know what I got myself into. So I was trying. I think I just got. She's still climbing. I'm still here. It's a really nice view though. How you doing? Fine says dance. <laughs> I'm doing fine, except I need to rest because I can't use my left hand because it's too tired. But the more I rest, the colder I get. And then I can't use any of my muscles because I'm freezing. So <laughs> <laughs> I'm uh, stuck between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try it again. Yeah. Are you coming down now or going No, I'll, I'll do it. I'll, I'll do another uh, attempt here. Good, but I think I need to come down. They're still uh, climbing, going a different route. Way up there. I don't know if you can see that. There's Sarah. So we're just doing, a, I guess, like a little photo shoot. I'm just talking about like inspiration and um, like motivation and just pushing yourself to the limits and uh, pushing yourself basically to success. I think that's gonna be my idea. I'm not exactly sure yet, but just thinking about it, uh, it's going great so far. Like I'm exhausted and I've only done this once and this is like their fourth time going up. So if you're curious about the gear that I have on me right now, I have the slide light. So this is just anchored right onto the camera, right onto the bottom plate. It's going around and just looped onto the harness itself. So I can't drop my camera. And a really good thing is that this is really adjustable. So I can just unclip this and pull it up or down. So I can adjust the length of this. So if I want to take the camera and swing it out and take some photos or get the video shot, then I can just extend this as long as I can. But if I want to like do anything like just swapping lenses, then I shorten it as much as I can. So if I do end up dropping it, it's not a big drop. Um, on the other end, 
I have the pro pad and the capture. On the other side, where my lenses are, um, I have this lens kit, so it just swings around. And on here, I have a 50mm prime 1.8. And on the other side, I have the 24 1.8. And, well, the lens that I'm using right now is the 10 to 18, so I'm using three lenses all at once. It's a lot easier if I had just two, so I can easily take this one off, pop it on this, and then swap lenses. But since I am using three, I kind of have to like take the lens off, put it underneath my arm, take the other one off and pop it on. So it's a little bit more risky if I end up dropping like one of these bad boys and it's going to cost me like $1,500. So it's a pretty costly mistake. So this thing is absolutely amazing. Use this all the time whenever I have like shoots where I don't want to be carrying my bag and I was going back to my gear back and forth. Just this stays on you the entire time. Swap lenses super fast. That's basically the gear that I have on me right now. And uh, I highly recommend it. Let's go back to the rock climbing though. How was the climb? It was good. Harder than I remembered it to be. <laughs> make it to the top. Pardon? Did you make it to the top? Yeah. Wouldn't have let him come down if he didn't. Yeah. <laughs> Outfit change. <laughs> Came prepared. I'm now playing a different character. <laughs> so you're doing another climb. So what level is this then? 12. What is this? 12A? Yeah, which is like definitely peak of my my abilities right now. So it's gonna be on top rope. Also, we're just spent. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so <laughs> uh, we were here since five six. What was it? Just uh, before six a.m. Five a.m. Oh yeah, because we were playing on four thirty, but we started like <laughs> five a.m. Trying to catch a sunrise, but it's complete overcast. So. Yeah. Didn't really work out, but yeah, it's 11 right now. Been here for a while. So tired, got no sleep last night. Uh, we were location scouting the area to see which places to climb, which ones would be the best for photography and taking uh, videos. I got home at like midnight. So got like three hours of sleep. And uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know how they're managing actually raw climb on this thing with barely any sleep and this cold weather i'm even wearing gloves so like my camera's so cold and they're doing it barehanded actually climbing i came in like a wrecking ball <laughs> <laughs> how'd you do i did it well i mean I did most of it. I did 90, what, I 98 percent of it. Almost made do. it to the top. <laughs> I did what Ryan could do. Was it more move to the top? Yeah, uh, well maybe two. Like, I think two you were one away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that was one, really cruxy. one hard move away. <laughs> that was really cruxy. Yeah. That was fun though. So we are now trekking back. That was a fun shoot. I was thinking this successful. 